So I've lived in Maryland for 43 years and I've never been to Hava de Grace. And today we decided to venture out and check the place out and everything seems closed. Like I don't get it, it's Saturday. Oh well. Life moves pretty fast. You don't stop and look around once in a while. You could miss it. So, Roger's house, which is right over there, is the oldest house or oldest structure in Habit of Grace. It survived the 1813 burning of Habit of Grace during the war. Wow, the more you know. It's part of the Star Spangled Banner National Historic Trail. So, there was a Commodore named John Rogers, and he was credited with firing the first shot of the war in June, June 23rd of 1812. Mm. And this is the, that's what the Rogers house is. That is his home. We found a book and antique store here in Hava de Grace, and they've got some of the coolest shit in here. My favorite being... The Millennium Falcon. I found the piece de resistance of cheese. Charger Banks. Another one that ruined the franchise. It ain't the original, so I'm not gonna get too excited, but memories. So we had lunch at River City, got four and a half stars and I don't know, I, I gave it a C plus maybe. C plus, I think that's fair. It wasn't the best, it wasn't the worst, but it got the job done, we're well fed, and now we're gonna go find the lighthouse. We're gonna go see the lighthouse, is that what we're doing? Yeah. All right, lighthouse it is. So, over the years, um, whenever I saw images of Habit de Grace, they've kind of shown the little downtown area that we were just at, but they also have this lighthouse. And on pictures, it's, you know, looks like this grand thing. I've always wanted to see it. So here we are at Concord Park, and it's literally the smallest lighthouse I've ever seen in my entire life. I can't believe how small this thing is. You gotta check this out. I mean, you can see people there. Hopefully that gives you an idea of scale. It's tiny. A little disappointed, now I know how women feel. Yeah. A lot of algae in the water here. I wouldn't say it's the uh, most picturesque water I've ever seen, but hey, you know, it's water. We're out of the house. That's what I'm looking at. Apparently they offer free ice cream here, so McKenna and I want to partake. Yes. Is it free, really? See, that kid knows. All right, let's see what they got. Okay, here we go. That, that kid was right. Free, completely free. I told you. That's my favorite word, free. It's totally not part of my diet, and my diet's been screwed to hell this week, but you know what? YOLO, baby. YOLO. So not only have we had a pleasant time in the little historic area of uh, Hobbit Grace, we're here down by the water, we're by like an extremely small lighthouse. It's got a whole world record or something. But in addition to all of that, we got a little local talent here, playing some music for us and showing us a good time. All in all, it's, it's been a pretty good day. I, I, I can't lie. You know, it's been fun just getting out of the house. And when you don't know what else to do, go explore your area and see what's out there. I mean, 43 years and this is the first time I'm here. Shame on me.